with another banger. We're going to be talking about ApeCoin USD. ApeCoin USD, APE USD. I'm going to be going over all new levels. As you guys can see, ApeCoin is having a heavy pull down. Heavy, heavy pull down. Most cryptos are having this pull down. If you look at Ethereum, Bitcoin, Dogecoin, Solana, Shiba Inu, Cardano, they're all having this pull down. So it's not a coin Pacific crash, right? So it came from about $7.60. It's down to $5.40. This is exactly why I try to give you guys the best levels down 32% crazy stuff. Okay, so let's get straight into it. Smash the like button. Subscribe if you are new to the channel. Make sure you go watch the video before this one on Dogecoin. I got a video right before this one on Dogecoin. Make sure you go watch it right there. Thank you. And also subscribe. Get the channel over 10K subscribers by the end of the year. But as you can tell, we had a resistance. Let me zoom in a little bit so you guys can appreciate this. Had a resistance at about $7.25. What happened at this level? Okay, so first price came down. Hit the support. Support ran up. Resistance, resistance, and price fell down. What is that telling us? That's telling that ApeCoin does not want to go higher. It wants to start going lower. Okay, so now that we see clear resistance, what are we looking for next? We're looking for the support level to break. Does it break? Tries to hold and then here, breakage. Next level is a buying level. Do we get any buying pressure off this level? We got a little bit here. You see that buying pressure? Did the buying pressure confirm? No, it didn't. Almost tested that resistance level. I mean, uh, the buying level as a resistance that's usually bearish. And then we got that downpour. Even came back up to the support level and tested that resistance. So a classic support turn resistance. And now look at that deep recline. Okay, very, very important. So now what we want to be looking at is first, for ApeCoin to have any type of up movement, it needs to break through resistance levels. And I think the resistance level that would be key, I do see one below this one, but the actual key one is at $5.60. So we're going to be watching this to see what type of movement, if we can start breaking out of this resistance level, because we'll be looking for a push up. And this will be the key point. It's either going to break down or it's going to actually push above it and test that support and then go higher. OK, so this would be the scenarios we'd be looking for when that resistance level breaks. If a new resistance level actually comes in, like, say, um, ApeCoin actually starts pulling down, then I'll probably have a new resistance level, but still looking for this scenario at the new resistance level. But once that comes, I'll let you guys know. We have a buying pressure level at about five dollars even. So looking for a buying pressure. Also, it is a support in one. So what we can do is I'm going to take this support level off. This support level off right there okay now also check we'll start watching ethereum ethereum is finally pulling down so i'm about to start buying ethereum also just let you guys know that i probably have a video coming out over the weekend or next week or something but looking to buy ethereum at these prices so five dollars to five dollars and sixty these are the only levels i'm watching remember this is a support level and a buying level this is a resistance level that i'm looking forward to break on the upside so main levels that we're looking for right now on ApeCoin, make sure you guys watch it. Seem like we're going to be getting some downpour. So watch that $5 level. And if that $5 level does break, I'll give you guys one more support level just in case we get like um, any fast type of movements. I put it at about $4 and um, I put it at about $4.85. Four, four and 4 dollars 85 cents let me turn this actually blue because this is just a pure support okay so main levels looking for ape coin anything changes i'll update you guys make sure you join the team that's that first link in the description and always remember none of this is a recommendation to buy or sell anything this is for educational purposes on this is for education purposes only so don't trade anything you see or hear in the video and i will catch you guys in the next one